Welcome to the adventure of a lifetime, or at least a Saturday. Our epic quest for gear takes us deep into the heart of pawn shops, thrift stores, music stores, and the occasional restaurant. Come with us as we find killer gear, awesome places along the way, and even some good local eats. Join us in search of gear. Well, hello. It's a Daryl. It's a me. Hi, ladies and gentlemen. Richard here. Daryl. Daryl. And uh, we are doing something we've been wanting to do for a while, which is returning to Tallahassee. Yep, Tallahassee. Been waiting to go for a few months because we were wanting to see if they get new inventory. So today, it's 8 o'clock. We're going to make it out there and, I don't know, see some things. Try to talk Daryl into grabbing some snacks on the way. And uh, yeah, it's uh, way too early for me, but that's cool. I'm excited. And yeah, it's actually been about a year, a little over a year. Yeah, I've been up since three. I've been ready to go since three. But Daryl's raring to go. <laughs> yeah. Which is why he's in shorts and no jacket. At 46 degrees, yeah. But it's okay. It's getting warm. The sun's coming out. I got another four more hours to, for it to get warmer. It'll be fine. And I'm just going to dress like this all day. So uh, yeah, don't cheat on anybody, kids, because this could be your truck. To Tallahassee. So we're, of course, starting at a rest, stopping at a rest stop. Hey, there's waving me to give me the drugs. That's just kidding. We're just joking. So many night drugs. All right, guys, we are now in Tallahassee. So the there's their hills. illustrious KFC and a Chevron with a food mart as well, fancy. And uh, there's Hustler Hollywood. That's kind of interesting. But yeah, so it's pretty cool that we are in our state capital. And uh, also, you know, times being the way they are in America right now, everybody's kind of been warned to stay away from the capital. And I didn't even think about that. So here we are in the state capital, yeah. the day before the insurrection or whatever's gonna happen. And uh, let's see if we can find some cool gear. Super buffet. We're heading down to uh, Monroe oh, shit, Street. 
Actually, we're gonna hit this Captain America car right here. Woo! Yeah, I think Daryl. At the stop sign, turn left onto <laughs> Tupelo Terrace, then turn left onto Toria Drive. I think Daryl accidentally spotted a Cash America pond that we didn't hit up last time. Yep. Nice. It's a nice one, too. There's a PV22 on the rack mount. It's kind of cool. Pot HD. Dope. Back line, 300 watt. Little uh, controller for your dog. That's pretty cool. Hey, for Kyle, there's a crate 120 watt solid state head. Yeah. That's cool. That's some mic stand and stuff. Pongoos. Put them in a snare. Ooh, mine They look pretty stock. There's a D. Yes, ma'am. 10%. Oh. So yeah, that wasn't too bad. Uh, they had some cool stuff, some deals on there. Yeah, I like half a mile, make a U-turn. Yeah, so um, <laughs> I like the uh, the bases. The selection bases were really good. Um, yeah, good uh, Continue straight, then use the left lane to make a U-turn. A couple symbols that I. I might actually be interested in if there's nothing else we find but oh there's a there's a pawn shop there I think. Alright, on to the next Somewhere. one. Somewhere. I will be waiting. Alright, we're going to Guitar Center, which is somewhere back here. Uh, if you guys watch our first Tallahassee trip, we didn't really have time to hit up the guitar center. So we didn't go. Today we have a little bit more time to get some stuff done and check out everything we can. And uh, so we're gonna hit that up. Then we may have to go left somehow. But right now we're lost. So we put one next to each other. So we figured out the uh, Cash America that we just went to was actually the replacement for the one that we went to last year that they apparently torn down. Have torn down. Interesting. Don't parking Wednesdays. Let's hope uh, Guitar Center isn't torn down. Yeah. Hey, is that it? That's it right there. Yay. Oh, shoot. It snuck up on us. Check you out. Like uh, one of the worst drivers my job has ever had and used to say, if it was a snake, it would have bit me. <laughs> All right, so we just went into Guitar Center. Really wasn't much to it. Um, did have a nice Ludwig kit I was kind of drooling over, but other than that, not not a whole lot. And I overheard a guy say to another customer there, yeah, you might want to try Music Masters. They're five minutes up the road, so we're going to see if we can find them. Yep. But they weren't talking to us. We just kind of overheard that. Yep. Uh, yeah, we're going to be turning left here. Turn gonna... left. <laughs> Thank you. And uh, we're going to try and find this music place and... If we hit a uh, pawn shop before then, we're going to hit that up. Um, but yeah, we're going to turn left on the street. This one's going to go down to the Capitol and all the other stuff. So so this is Monroe, and it's got, seems to have all the pawn shops and music stores on it. So I had to turn off that Megadeth song about diarrhea to uh, show you guys that we are at Central Pond, which this was one of the better ones we went to last time. Yeah, Clint bought that DVD for like really cheap. Yeah, I go for a couple Turn TVs. left onto North Monroe <laughs> Street. So we're going to check this out. The Preston Chorus. That's cool. The old bandit and whatnot. The white's pretty cool. What kind of subs are those over there? Quick recap, nothing of note. Alright, All right, last year Daryl found some cool bases uh, for a good price here. Got two for really good deals. We parked in the safe spot too. 850 on that. Oh wow. I got a T45. <laughs> a 375. What? 
TV. Right. Oh. So Daryl and I were joking uh, last time we were here. He bought a couple bases. This time I bought a base. I've wanted a T40 series base forever, guys. So I'm pretty excited about this. Needs a little bit of cleaning up and some work, but uh, 240 bucks plus tax. It was like 257. So yeah, I'm mad about that at all. Listen to Fatal Diarrhea by Megadiff. But uh, man, this is, I'm pretty stoked on that bass. So I think uh, Daryl and I, we're looking for lunch, but if we hit Music Masters first, we might go there. Yeah, if we hit it first, then we're gonna go there. I'm looking to see what there is because we'll probably hit another thing right before I find out where we're gonna eat for lunch. So we found this place called Masa. There's a place in Pensacola called Sushi Masa. This place says it has sushi, so it's gotta be close enough, right? <laughs> Check out this tree. Proceed to the root. Sick tree. But uh, Masa Tallahassee. I already like it. <laughs> it smells kind of gross though. Mm. Got these crab wontons. Mm. Daryl seal of approval. Mine too, these are really good. Mm -hmm. Alright, I got this volcano roll, looks pretty good. Daryl got, what did you get, Daryl? Some sort of express platter. So, we'll tell you how it is, because I'm about to eat this thing. Mm hmm. So, what'd you think of uh, lunch, Daryl? I'm full. Yeah, me too. So, we're gonna take a nap while we drive to the music store and these next couple of pawn shops. <laughs> Just driving. Just driving. Look out, Barracuda! What? Oh, I think that was our turn off. Music Masters! <laughs> Twin Weaver. Oh, the Delta Blues. Oh man, I've been wanting one of these. That's about right. Yes, yeah, of course. Let's go down. Hey guys, is there anything we have to buy today? Oh, really, we just came in to look around. We uh, heard y'all existed from. Uh... Very cool. Yeah. They got a PV grind. Go for it. Yeah, that's really nice. I was just looking at that like it's just... Yes. What do they got on the VB3, man? Huh? So what do they got on the VB3? Two, two grand? Ooh. It was originally three. But it's... So there's Music Masters, which we just left. And uh, I got some footage on the inside. It's pretty, pretty darn cool place hey, if you're in Tallahassee and you're looking for some sort of musical equipment or at least a deal on some musical equipment that's where I would go absolutely the other place I don't know yeah that's that one where we had this Fulmers yeah yeah this place had a PV bandit last time Woo! don't run into this lady Camouflage the gym be back there. Mm. Oh, that's a keyboard. Keyboard amp. Metalhead? Bandit and the GK is still back here. Not much in the way of instruments. So Fulmer's is pretty crappy. As soon as we pulled in uh, the parking lot, an employee... Uh, Hit my car with a, another customer's car door. Yeah, didn't apologize to either of us. And uh, I filmed a little bit in there and I'll show you. So. It's shit. You Don't know, ever go to the Fulmers. You know where not to shop. Yeah. That'll pretty, be the last time we go there. It's a pretty crappy thing to do, honestly, to not even say, hey, that's my bad. I'm sorry. You know. We are in lovely downtown, wherever we are. Tallahassee. Tallahassee. Georgia. Georgia. And here's the Florida <laughs> capital of the whole state. That's why, the they, barricade up. that's why they put palm trees 
And uh, yeah, yeah that is a barricade. They just were doing work there or something. Yeah, construction, so they got a yeah. built-in barricade. Nice. Yeah, interesting. Yeah, old state capital. Let's see two rioters are on the steps. Florida Heritage. Yeah, look at that riot going on, you guys. <laughs> Oh, there you go, Florida State Capitol. There you go. <laughs> Hardcore right. You remember the last time we were here, those people like LARPing? Yeah. <laughs> They're over here on the left in the park. Live action role yeah. play. Yeah. They were, uh, they were LARPing like, uh, that, uh, God, what is it? V uh, Fang? Red, Red Fang. Red Fang, there it is. Video. It's so funny. I do like these trees with the willow in them. This is uh, coming up on that pawn shop we came to last time that was all over expensive. Where was that one? Was, back was it? I thought it was over here. Uh, I don't know. It's down here somewhere. Yeah. We might skip that one. But uh, I think we're heading toward the Cash America pawn. Yeah. Wish us luck. Which is all the luck. Yeah, it's like once you get, Daryl and I were talking about this, once you get to like South Monroe, it really kicks in with like that, uh, well, the crap part of the city, just like in Pensacola. Yeah. Once you get to a certain part, it's just like, oh, hello, here comes all the crap. And, you know, they never disappoint. Way over there is Cash America Pond, number two in town. And uh, they were kind of garbage last time, so let's see if they stepped their game up. I'm gonna hide the camera now so we don't get robbed. Mitchell looks kind of cool. Mitchell? Yeah, I like the rails in it. I like their aftermarket. Got a Keith Urban guitar. That is an old road star with the Power Rocker Bridge that some idiot has painted on. That makes me angry. So Daryl's trying to find us another pawn shop or something to check out. It's eight uh, minutes. Closes soon. Closes at three. We got time. Yeah. So yeah, there's that. And uh, it's Cash America. You, you saw in the video, pretty darn mad about that old road star being painted all bad and right over the logo and everything. West on town South Shop Center, then turn right onto South Adams Street. Honestly, if the headstock didn't have that weird hole drilled in it, I probably would have bought it. I mean, I could glue in there a, a stick or something but that just makes me mad nobody respects yeah. the classics you know yeah. angry Shit. no respect Daryl was with me I debated on it for a while <laughs> all right cruising around Tallahassee on the big roads now school of communication and disorders back there that's crazy because communication is my disorder <laughs> So do you guys remember uh, back in the 1720s when General Tallahassee landed in Florida and proclaimed that all he could see was Florida and that this would be the capital because he was a fan of big letters? It's historical. You can look it up. Huh. This is Chris Gaines Street. Nice. Yeah. Also historical. Best rock and roll artist ever. There's a crane. I don't know if you guys can see it down there. It's a Florida State bird. That's also not true. <laughs> <laughs> You're right, James. Sad but true. <laughs> yeah. What else? This place is closed Saturday and Sunday, so they changed their hours. Oh, yep. Whack. I don't know what else is around here. We, have, we haven't been this far through Tallahassee. So Daryl and I went to an Army Navy store. It was pretty cool. Army surplus store, I mean. I don't know if you can tell. We got hats. <laughs> got hats, we got hats, we got all the hats. <laughs> it's a song I just wrote. There's Novelties, Deli, Beer, and Wine grocery store. So we are at a uh, kind of a backwoods town between, I guess, Tallahassee and Quincy. Trying to find our way to Highway 90, which I think will be pretty possible. We still got the availability of GPS, but... Uh, we're basically turning it off right now and adventuring, trying to see what we can do. We know that Highway 90 should be somewhere north, just as Highway 98 should be somewhere south. So we're pretty sure we can find our way back without having to use GPS. So right now we're just going to be adventuring until we find a way to get back 
to the house. Maybe we'll see some cool old side, like roadside attractions. Yeah, like world's largest ball of yarn or a big ass industrial park. You never know. Yeah. In a prison. Hey, look. A friggin' prison for no reason. Gasden. Correctional yeah. facility. All right. Yeah. Well. Boy, are we so lucky. Party on. Thank you, Garth. All right, guys. Uh, thanks for watching this in search of gear. Yep, I'm Daryl. I'm Richard, and I will leave you with a uh, demo of the new T45 base I got provided it works when I get home. <laughs> thanks for watching. See you guys.